Oscar De La Hoya is fiercely defending his fighter, Virgil Ortiz Jr. Following the young boxer's contentious win over WBC interim junior middleweight champion Serhi Bohachuk last Saturday. The bout has ignited significant debate in the boxing community, with many questioning the legitimacy of the decision. De La Hoya took to social media, posting a fiery rebuttal to critics of Ortiz Jr., but his attempt to counter the backlash only intensified the controversy. The CompuBox statistics he shared, which he intended as evidence in Ortiz's favor, instead showed Bohachuk landing more effective punches. Despite these numbers, the judges awarded the fight to Ortiz, fueling accusations that the Nevada judging was flawed. In his social media tirade, De La Hoya dismissed critics with a scathing remark. You don't know about boxing and the new a Virgil Ortiz. However, this defensive posture failed to convince fans who remained skeptical of the decision. Looking ahead, De La Hoya, along with Ortiz's trainer, Robert Garcia, has suggested Terence Crawford as a potential opponent for Ortiz. This bold move may backfire, given the current backlash and the shadow of the contentious Bohachuk fight. Fans are wary of another high-profile match with unresolved controversies. And pairing Ortiz with Crawford, who also had a disputed win over Israel Madrimov, could be risky for pay-per-view sales. Instead of deflecting criticism, De La Hoya might consider advocating for a rematch between Ortiz and Bohachuk. A second fight would offer Ortiz an opportunity to validate his victory and resolve lingering doubts. Without addressing the controversy surrounding the initial bout, Ortiz's prospects in the competitive 154-pound division may suffer. The reality is that Ortiz may not be the future star De La Hoya envisions. Critics are drawing comparisons to Alfredo Angulo, suggesting Ortiz is a solid but not extraordinary fighter. Unless he can convincingly address the doubts from his recent performance, Ortiz's ascent could face serious obstacles.